morning everybody so this is where I stayed in the little lovers honeymoon suite last night so I stayed two nights inside the Packwood Hotel inside Marion this, this place is the bomb so you get your own little it's the outside cabin I'll walk you out really nice suggest anybody 75 bucks super nice Friday night it's the garden shed so elk elk come out here like she feeds elk and some grunt uh, there's the library <clears throat> she feeds elk uh, like watermelon rinds and all kinds of stuff so yeah that's where I stayed the garden shed the honeymoon suite is really nice this lady does it all for hikers here she is super cool she takes care of people she'll let you sleep on the porch if it's raining she's had this whole patio covered with hikers and she just takes care of hikers she gave me a free pair of snow gloves she gives free coffee free tea free hot chocolate uh, 35 bucks for a room and then five dollars she'll do your laundry for you you can't beat it this has been my favorite place on trail and every hiker here has said the same thing nothing but really she's just a great lady I strongly suggest coming to the Packwood Hotel. The historic Hotel Packwood is what it's called. Hotel Packwood. Definitely come here. Alright, it's Saturday, 1032. I am attempting to go hike by myself now. Everybody's backed out. Colin was going to roll with me. Nausicaa was going to go, but she's backed out too. So... It still shows it's going to snow and stuff tomorrow, too, so whatever. I'm coming over here outside the market, and I'm going to try to hitch out. All right, so we're at like 5,200 feet here, and it's just beautiful. So we got snow. Trail's clearing up, but I'm going to turn the corner here. And I'm going to climb up another thousand feet. Trails, it snowed, it's cold, it's like 30s. Right now, probably 39. Might even be 40. Um, just want to say thank you to Winston for getting me back on trail. Sitting there hitchhiking sucks ass. <laughs> that was really cool of you to take me up. Ah, your kids got to see the snow, that was cool. Glad you're doing good with your kids you know what I mean uh, we had a little talk cool guy really appreciate Winston get me back on trail all right it's coming down pretty good now <clears throat> how fast it can change up here so fast <sighs> ah, I love it this I don't care about snow snow on me all day as long as it's not freezing rain freezing rain Screw that. Whew. Well, I want to thank all my followers and wife and kids for letting me come on this epic adventure. It is coming down good now. Um, here's the trail. I'm going to keep going. I'm still almost to the top. We're going to keep pushing. I can handle snow. I have everything I need. I got lots of warm clothes. I got micro spikes. I got lighters. I got stoves. I got fuel. I got. Should be fine. It may get cold tonight, but I'm good down to zero degrees. Whew, look at this. How effing beautiful. <laughs> Alright, guys, I gotta put this away and push on. It's gonna be a super super duper trail starting to stick starting to stick all right guys there was the mountain i showed you half an hour ago it is coming down and it's coming down really hard let me walk over i'm at the top a little saddle here so it's coming down coming down hard Woo! i love it Guys, what a difference an hour can make out here. Look at this. Trail's already getting covered. I have a little 
couple trees blocking me right now, so I took my phone out. I'm gonna turn around. I'm gonna turn the camera around, not turn around, but yeah, it's coming down. I've only been out here an hour, and I went from sun to snow real quick. So it's 1:30. Keep headed down. I did not get a chance to text my friends. It said dank T-Mobile service at the at the gap and I didn't have any service maybe because the snow is coming down really good. But it don't matter. Uh, nobody said I never said I would text anybody or I never said I'd have service. No one's expecting it. So we're all good. There's people out here. Every half an hour somebody will come by, maybe, but I'm not worried. I got all the gear I need. I got all the warmth I need. I'm dreaming of a white September. It is coming down and thick. It is 1.30 and those are my tracks. The trail is disappearing, but I don't think there's going to be a problem. This is absolutely freaking amazing. It is coming down. I love it. I'm not cold. Holding my sticks under my arm. I got my hands in my pocket. Trying not to get my first pair of gloves wet. I have three pair. I have a knit pair. I have a Seattle Seahawks cheap pair from the grocery store and then I have my big snow gloves. Those are my emergency backup, last resort, let the other hands ones get wet. But wow, look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Why wouldn't you come out here and enjoy this? You only live once. Look at the smile. Hopefully the smile stays a smile because this is what I enjoy. I enjoy this. My pack. So yeah, as long as you stay dry. I can wait. I can get a tent spot. I got warm. I got a Z-Lite pad to put under my 5.7 R-Value air mattress. Now I'm into... Now I'm into first tracks on the snow. This is... This is uh, like an hour and a half on the trail. It changed. Real, yeah, I got to do this. Hell yeah. <laughs> Here's a tent spot. What do you say, go for it? Hell no, we're gonna keep pushing on. It's 1.30. I'm gonna turn the camera around again. All right. Mama G, where you at? Don't go out there. You're risking your life. Yeah, I am kind of stupid because I am solo. But you can see, last night was a big part of the storm. There ain't shit on the ground. Who cares about an inch? As long as you're not getting wet. Now if the winds kick up, I'll remember where I'm at and I'll remember the low spots and the covered spots. If I gotta hike back a mile or whatever back and forth, I'm gonna check out all the safe spots for setting up a tent. But I got to put my hand in my pocket because I don't have a glove on it and it is getting cold. Gloves in my pocket underneath my frog togs poncho and my rain jacket. I'm not cold at all right now, but my right hand is getting cold. All right, see ya. All right, guys, I've stopped here underneath this tree. Got me a little shelter for a second here. Taking some fluid in, drinking, and I'm gonna eat something to keep the, keep the motor warm, keep the body warm. All right, I just passed a guy uh, going southbound with his dog. He said he passed a couple people, PCTers, so I just came out of the snow, I'm to the top of this, not to the top top, but I'm to the top here. 
And I got a blue sky for a minute, but check out this view. Pretty damn cool. This kind of looks like a spot. This kind of looks like a spot right here, and I think I'm going to take it. Alright, time to set up. <laughs>